buses, the alligators who wallow. Hello, this is Gary Perlman from the African Gazette. Today, desertification is growing in Africa. As the Sahara grows larger, people worry, what will Africa become? Can we stop it in time? But people have noticed this epidemic and have started a project called the Great Green Wall. Eleven countries have taken on the challenge. People plant trees and other types of plants. This wall stretches over 4,000 miles from Senegal to Djibouti. But, at the same time, can they do it? Will they plant the plants best? There are lots of things that we need to consider. Over two-thirds of Africa is desert or dry land, and the Sahara Desert takes out about a third of Africa. Will the Great Green Wall really save that? Will Africa turn into a dry wasteland? Could millions of people have no access to fresh drinking water? Could millions, maybe even billions, die from famine, disease, or water problems, or even drought? Farmers have lost their land because it turns into desert, and sand is not good for growing crops. But we all want to know, will the Great Green Wall be successful? Out to you! Desertification is generally caused by droughts and when plants in that area do not receive enough water to survive, they die. Then, with no roots to hold the soil down, the soil blows away, changing the once fertile land into a desert. And now for a complaint from the editor.